All right, what's going on everyone? Welcome to Now on Investing. Today we have a watch, a review. I've already unboxed it as you can see. And it, the box came with this fancy Pelican case from Invicta or Dive case, what they're calling it. So let's go ahead and check it out. We got a few watches in here. I've, so far I've reviewed one out of the four that's in here. So we're gonna go through all of them. But for right now, we're gonna, we're gonna go over this behemoth of a watch. This, look, look how big this is this is the invicta sea hunter invicta sea hunter from here to here is 70 millimeters this watch is massive i'm gonna say i didn't know it was this big when i ordered it obviously the picture was a very deceiving if i knew it was this big i probably would not have ordered it and it's heavy it is really heavy they call it the sea hunter i call it the sea anchor because how big and massive and heavy this thing is it's not an automatic it is a chronograph or it is a, a quartz um uh all these buttons function uh this part flips back and you can change the time with it the bezel functions also um as you can see the clock is ticking it has the day of the week um <clears throat> the the it's huge huge the, the sea anchor Invicta sea anchor or sea hunter as they call it see that detail there on the back we get the more detailed information model number is three 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 six four flame fusion crystal pro diver master of the ocean should be called anchor of the ocean uh swiss movement water resistance to 200 meters um yeah so this color is the silver with the black um and i'm gonna pause and show it to you guys on wrist all right so we're back i've already resized it so it's not gonna move around too much but this is how it looks on my wrist look how how high that sits up um again invicta sea anchor on the bottom sea hunter there's my sea anchor that's all i'm gonna tell folks they, they, i will never ever call this by his real name because this is an anchor this thing's massive um definitely a talking piece if you ever wear it out but it is heavy like even on my weight i'm 6'4 even on my wrist i'm 6'4 280 and on my wrist it feels like a weight so um uh, it will get some wrist time but not much people i mean i just it just feels off and awkward it doesn't feel it feels heavy like i have like i'm wearing a, a wrist weight and that's what i don't like about it um other than i do i do like the uniqueness of how big it is it is different um, you have to be a nice size person to wear something like this. Um, but this is the Invicta Sea Hunter. Um, it's really huge. You guys let me know what you think about it. If you would ever wear something like this, if you ever seen anything this big, I mean, it's taken up my wrist. <laughs> it's, uh, so <clears throat> definitely different. Uh, I bought it for Black Friday and, um, it came with the case and some patches. I, I gave the patches away. It came with this patch and that patch and this patch actual iron on patches and uh i gave it to a guy at my job he actually does diving so i figured you know stuff like that and that you know he can relate to i don't actually dive so again this is victor c hunter hit that like button subscribe button notification bell let me let me know what you see in the video and i will see you guys on the next watch review